pizza. Let's try that. Many of you may be wondering, what is the best flavored pizza for the price? And today we have four different frozen pizzas, all at a different price value, and we're gonna be taste testing them to see which one is the best. Because one, pizza's good. Two, we're hungry. Three, pizza's really good. Yes. Everyone loves pizza. You can have pizza in the morning, at night, late, late at night. You can have a cold, you can have a hot, you can have a lukewarm. No, no lukewarm. It, I mean, you I'm could. a, I'm a, That's, all I'm nothing. just saying, in <laughs> every poor college kid and grade school child knows that the best snack is just a quick little frozen pizza right out of the fridge. Little personal ones, mm. little tiny ones. And we're gonna take blind taste tests and we're gonna figure out which one's the best. Mmm, I'm hungry. See, because when you're hungry, and you're a man, you want something convenient, simple, something that is so easy to make that the effort doesn't outweigh how much you're hungry. Is that right? Otherwise, let's face it, you'll probably just get takeout, fast food. Or just not eat. <laughs> Starvation. <laughs> the struggle is real. Personal size pizzas always go for like 13 minutes. But that begs the question, which personal size pizza is the best? College life would have said Totino's, cause Totino's. See, and I thought Totino's sucked. In high school? I'm putting that, like every time, I thought I was getting ripped off. I was like, mom, really, we're not poor. Well, <laughs> when you're a poor I'm college all... student, it definitely tastes a lot better than Top Ramen. I, I, I beg to differ. You love Top Ramen? Yeah, I love Top Ramen. Let's but see. pizza, for real, there's so many different kinds of frozen personal pizzas. We wanna know which one is the best for the price you're poor, you're hungry. I want to work on the money. You don't want to spend it on a crappy pizza. Our pizza's done! <gasps> we have transformed into Italiano. Italianos, because we are going to be trying the pizza. The best frozen pizza. Because the pizza pie is life, okay? The pizza it's pie me. is life. A camaroni. That's my name in Italian. Camaroni. Camaroni. Ooh, it's got a nice ring. My name is Ostinio. <laughs> Ostinio. 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 And the Camaroni. <laughs> you ever watch that Family Guy <laughs> where Peter Griffin, Peter Griffin tries to speak Italian? No. He's like, Oh, and ah. here comes the pizza. Pizza, pizza. See, back in my mother country of Italia. We would eat the pizzas all the time. I sound a little like Swedish. <laughs> <laughs> Accents are hard. Today, we are going to be having a four pepperoni pizzas and we are going to be figuring out which one is the best pepperoni pizza for the money. Oh, okay. <laughs> is that Asian Italian? No, it's Mario. All right, we have the four pizzas here in front of us and I think we should be judging them off of appearance because appearance is a very important. If you are serving your friends, you want to make sure it is presentable. Yes. <laughs> I think this one definitely wins the presentation. That it one is a little gooey in the middle. It's got a very good, rich look. You can hear your stomach. Your stomach <laughs> wants to eat some My pizza. stomach is very hungry. I would say a one, a two, a three, a four. Ooh, I agree. Cheers. Cheers, high five. Second is the aroma test. Which one has the best smell? Oh, that's wait, a, wait, that wait, one's a very nice. Bring it in here. Mm. Oh, that's nice. Very nice, very nice. Mm. A very rich. Reach a cheap smell. Ooh, that one oh, has a very uh, that one has a much of spices. Much of spices, yes. Mmm. Mm. That one smells rich. We don't have time for poor pizzas. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here, you peasant, with your poor pizza. That one Yay. smells a little burnt. <laughs> yes. Somebody left it in the oven a little too long. Oh, oh, this one smells very, very pepper. Very ripe for a for a bread. Like you can mm. smell, you can smell the carbs. Mm. Mm. Very strong oh, pepperoni very smell. I would say a one, a two, a three, a four. Ooh. In the same order as the appearance. Oh, oh, switch oh. One, <gasps> two, oh. three, four. Oh my goodness. 
That doesn't have a pepperoni. You don't like the aroma? It doesn't have a pepperoni. It doesn't smell like pepperoni, but it smells good. Yes. That one does not have pepperoni. Well, it fails the pepperoni test. Where's the pepperoni? Because it is missing the key ingredient <laughs> of pepperoni. So in the pepperoni smell. Well, let's free them. God bless America. <laughs> okay. Two verse two. These two? I think Go. we should do this. I see where you're going with this. Those two friends. These both came in the last place of the of the look and smell. Taste. Very oh. rigid. Very, very It's a very big. It doesn't it doesn't droop. No. It is a thick consistency with a fancy little uh, little chopped pepperonis. There. These look like Canadian bacon. Mmm. Has a good thick crust. Mmm. It's like a deep dish. Good. A lot of bread. Dish, yes, yes, lot of bread, but it's nice. It's crusty, but not too crusty. Mm. The amount of bread to... What accent is this? <laughs> <laughs> the amount of bread to the cheese and sauce. The is bread to cheese ratio? Bread to cheese and sauce ratio is... It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Lot of little uh, pepperoni beads. This one is not as firm. Not as firm? Mm -hmm. Very... Mm -hmm. Very flimsy. Very flimsy. Thin very, crust. Very thin. Thin crust. No! Uh -uh. <laughs> I say no! No! That is terrible! It has a strange aftertaste. Did I just go brush it? You did? <laughs> hi, 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 hi. I'm Mamma Mia. Oh no, I don't know. Get what back I need. Into character. I, I'm sorry, I'm here. <laughs> okay, so this one, it. Uh, not good! <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like a pickles, but there are no pickles on the pizza. No! no. no. If, you, if your pizza tastes like something it does not have, you do not eat that pizza anymore. It does taste like it has <laughs> pickles! <laughs> it <has> pickles. <laughs> this is our winner of the first round of first pizza taste. First round. Oh, yes. Where do we oh, begin? I'm going to eat at this one. <laughs> Yummy. Okay. Yes, okay. Your piece oh. is bigger than mine. <laughs> Very thick. Very is that a good consistency. Very Look at the size strong. of that. That is about a three quarter inch of pizza crust right there. That is nice. Oh, nice. Oh, the, the full, cheese. The full Ooh, the pepperonis. Cheese is falling. Lots of cheese in this mm. one. There's lots of cheese. Ooh. Ooh. I don't know how to explain it, but the, the pizza crust tastes like it is. <laughs> it, it, it's so good that it's making my mustache fall off. <laughs> it pops you in the mouth. Mm -hmm. Like it is. <laughs> It's like a magical pixie of dust. It, it kind of pops in your mouth. Mm. Okay, this one, the interesting I'm, looking, good smelling one. Yes, this one looks very rich. Uh, very expensive. It yes, he grew up on the Upper East Side of the Italia. It's kind of flimsy. Little juicy. It's very slippery. Mm -hmm. Little, little juicy. Okay. Oh. Mamma mia. I have found you! Mm. Definitely a lot more flavors. Yes. Many different spices. Yes. But like I said, it is a little bit soggy, a little, little bit wet. It's like when you leave a graham cracker in the milk too long, but then you put cheese and sauce on it and make a pizza. Oh, this is very nice, very flavorful. It's almost not even fair. I think it's a little bit difficult to choose between them. Between these two? Yes. For real? Yes. <laughs> This one is good, but it is a little bit soggy. I like my pizza to be crisp. Mm. How many jets do we have? It taste the both at the once. And let your taste buds decide. I think in the terms of flavor, this definitely does have the more Flavorful zest to it. Mm. I will go with you. Yes. Okay. Final round. We taste the winner from the first round, the winner from the second round, and we beat them together. Mm. Oh yes. A miniature mm. deep dish. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't know. It's still yummy. <clears throat> On three. One, two, three. three. This one! Yes! Ah! Ah, yes! Pricing! How would we go? Less to more? 
I would say. I think these two need to switch. I think we have it. I think this is it. Yes, me too. Let us find out the prices in the types of pizza that we have. Ooh, delicious. Okay, mm. if we had to guess what pizza was which, what would you say? Red Baron. Red Baron, I think. Totinos? Totinos, for sure, yes. Totinos, the only people who make the pepperonis like that. See. Si. Red Baron. You gonna say Red I Baron? I say Red Baron. Di giorno? Di giorno or freshetta? I, I say... No, no, no freshetta. Di giorno. What this one? I don't know. <laughs> I think this is something fancy. You think, like a what? Like a California pizza. Kitchen. And what is the actual pizza that we have before us? Close our eyes. Ooh. Oh, Kroger. Oh, my Kroger. What? Red Baron, yes, yes, ah. Di giorno, yes, yes. yes. What is that? Amy's Pizza. This is only a dollar? This? Oh, yes. A dollar? It's this okay in a pinch. Red Baron? Three dollars. $2.99. For two. Di giorno? Not delivery. Four dollars. Four dollars. And Amy's Pizza? Four seventy-nine. $4.79. Biggest bang for the dollar? Red Baron singles. The winner today. Yes. Okay! If you love this video as much as we loved eating the pizza in it, go ahead and smash that like button. Don't forget to join the tribe and subscribe to find out what other delicious foods are the best for the price. Yes! And don't forget to leave us a comment as to what you'd like to see us try next. And hit that notification bell so you can be alerted when we upload new content. We'll see you next Friday. Bye! Pineapple does not belong on a pizza. Pineapple does. Pineapples go in the fruit cocktail you get on the side. Who decides what goes on pizza and what doesn't? The, the Italians. No. Because <laughs> here in America... <laughs>